Welcome back to MMA Al Dente. I am the guy who picked Joe Gianetti to defeat Mike Trezano. And I'm here to talk about Giga Chikadze versus Alex Caceres. Caceres is 35 years old, 21 and 13 as a pro, and he's giving up two inches of height and a half inch of reach to 35 year old Chikadze, who is 14 and 3. This is a cool fight. It's good that Chikadze's back. He's had a long time off. And Caceres, he's got a lot of momentum as of late. A lot of momentum. Got a big win over uh, Daniel Pineda in his most recent fight. And that was a fucking an awesome fight. He came very close to putting him away. But uh, I don't remember if that got fight of the night or whatever. But it was a memorable fight for me at least. And before that, he knocked out Julian Arosa with a head kick. That was one of Alex Caceres' only legit knockouts. And even though it came against a guy with a potentially weak chin in Arosa, it was still very fucking impressive. Just a very accurate kick, sneaky and fast, and right on the chin. And he also knocked, uh, submitted uh, Sangwoo Choi with a rear naked choke just out of nowhere. He's definitely had a lot of successes of late. As far as his losses go, he's got 13 of them. Only one of them is by TKO, which is important here because he's fighting an excellent striker. And that loss was to Francisco Rivera, who, despite being a striker, I guess, like a Chikadze, they're totally different strikers. Francisco Rivera is just a very powerful brawler, and he ended up catching Caceres. His, uh, he's got seven losses via submission. I think all seven of them are rear naked chokes. We've seen plenty of them in the UFC to excellent fighters. Uh, fit, Uriah Faber, Crone Gracie, Jason Knight, Jimmy Hedis, excellent grappler. I don't think Chikadze is going to submit him. So, whatever. And uh, he also lost five times via decision. Caceres has 21 wins. 11 of them come via finish. Four TKOs, seven submissions, and ten decisions. Probably a lot of his submission victories are rear naked chokes as well. Uh, most famously, I want to say he got uh, Sergio Pettis out of there in round three. That's maybe even his finest victory to date, especially with the way Pettis has panned out. Uh, he also beat Austin Springer by rear naked choke. Who is that? That's the guy who beat Chikadze by rear naked choke. So what, is, what else is there to even discuss here? Caceres via rear naked choke. That's it. Like, share, subscribe. I'm just kidding. There's more to talk about. Chikadze. He has three losses. One via submission. That's to Austin Springer on the Contender Series. Probably in Season 1 or something. Way back when. That was a Round 3 rear naked choke. And then he lost to... Uh, he lost uh, two decisions. To uh, Calvin Cater. And whoever the fuck else. Oh, this guy uh, Gil uh, Guardado. Well, Gil Guardado out-wrestled him. That was in the PFL, I believe. And uh, Calvin Cater beat him up on the feet for five rounds in a fight that was exciting and cool and whatever, but still largely dominant. That was the Calvin Cater show all the way. So Chikadze, he can be beaten on the feet, but you have to be a really good striker, probably really powerful, and... Uh, you know, beating him to the punch, which I don't think Caceres can do. Caceres doesn't have the boxing of Calvin Cater. Caceres is a really good striker in a lot of ways that I don't think are going to fool someone like Chikadze. You know, because Caceres is mainly kick heavy and fights at range. You know, I don't know what martial arts he trains in or whatever, but he's definitely more traditionalist kicker guy. And Chikadze, I think... Uh, will get the better of that style at the very least. You know, I think he'll, you know, I can't say he'll go through that style and knock Caceres out because that's a pretty tall order. But I don't think it's going to frustrate Chikadze in the way that Calvin Cater did with those punches. So I'm favoring Chikadze here. I think Chikadze should win this fight. I've seen him in close fights. He had that fight with Jamal Emmers on the feet that was very close. You know, really could have gone either way. And Jamal Emmers... Uh, Found a lot of success with punches as well. But Caceres, he's just not... Uh, he doesn't have the boxing and the power especially to really, uh, you know, take over the fight on the feet against Chikadze. I think Chikadze moves better than Caceres. I think he strikes harder, specifically with the kicks. I mean, that's Caceres' game. But 
Chikadze has got him outgunned, kicking wise, no doubt about it. And it, I can't, you know, it would surprise me a little bit if he's finished Caceres, but it's certainly not out of the realm of possibility. But I think he wins a decision. I think Chikadze wins a decision, keeps his fight on the feet. Caceres, look, he's a very dangerous submission artist. If he takes uh, uh, Chikadze down, he's in the realm of finishing him. You know, not like it's going to happen instantly, but Caceres, if he does take him down, he might turn a, turn a corner, hit a duck under, and take his back out of nowhere or whatever. Then, you know, if he gets any sort of positional advantage, he's a very good submission artist. And uh, he could get Chikadze out of there. But I think Chikadze will just be, in general, too strong. And I think he'll be technically too strong on the feet. And he's going to win this fight. Chikadze is the pick. Uh, uh, his money line is minus 235. I didn't bet on that, but I threw a sprinkle or two on his decision line at even money. So that's where I'm at. But I'm back in Chikadze for sure. It'd be cool to see Alex uh, Caceres win this fight. But I think to do it, he's got to outgrapple him. And Caceres, I don't think he's got the uh, wrestling prowess to get uh, Chikadze down. I think he's more of a crafty takedown artist and crafty striker and crafty submission artist. And that can come into play, but I don't think it's going to. I think uh, the craftiness is going to stay out of this and Chikadze is going to rough him up on the feet. Like, share, subscribe, all that horse shit. Check out my other videos.